Okay, in 1899, the Harriman Expedition visited Columbia Glacier. And one of the participants was a geologist named Grove Carl Gilbert, who worked for the U.S. Geological Survey, one of the leading geomorphologists, someone who studied landforms of this time. He took a photograph from this location showing the terminus of Columbia Glacier, filling the entire width of the water that you see to the north of us. This is the photo he took. As you can see, when you look at it compared to today, there is no glacier ice that is in place. Everything you see in the distance are icebergs that are calving off the terminus of the rapidly retreating Columbia Glacier, which is located a number of kilometers around the corner. If you notice out in the distance, there's a dark band at the top of the ridges there. And then as you go lower, it becomes lighter. Well, everything that had been, uh, everything that is lighter had been covered by glacier ice in the last 25 years.